What is cracking tutorials, you guys? I am back for another video. You guys, we are back. I miss you guys so flippin' much. How are you guys doing today, you guys? Today, I'm so excited because I'm so hungry. And today, we got, ch we got, we got Chippy. We got Mr. Mrs. Chipotle in the house, y'all. I was feeling very demure, very mindful. So I really wanted Chipotle. You guys, y'all know what it's gonna be right now. You already know it's gonna go down like crazy. Y'all already know it's gonna go down. Y'all know it's gonna go ham like never before. If y'all don't have a brief smacky moan and do not watch the videos, if it's not for you, you guys, we are about to go ham today. We gotta get into the festive season. Festive season. Mmm, oh my gosh. Yo, I got their new brisket. Y'all trying Chipotle's brisket for the first time? Let's see if it's Steven Sushi approved. Y'all know we don't go to Chipotle without, y'all know we don't hit up Chipotle without getting their queso and a little bit of their hot sauce, which is super, super spicy. If y'all haven't had their hot sauce before, y'all gotta try it, it's absolutely fire. Oh my gosh. And if y'all aren't just like, Let's mix this baby up. Thank you, Lord, Heavenly Father, for blessing this food, Lord. Blessed to go without Father. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's just like barbecue. That is bomb chipotle. What are y'all doing? What? What? Y'all really did that, Chipotle? Mmm. Wow. Well, that is so good. That is bomb, actually. Mmm! Mmm! Wow! Mindful AF. Chipotle, y'all being mindful and demure at the same time? Damn, y'all good. Okay, y'all, we're gonna do this the Latino way. Look at that. Look at that. Dip that baby a little mini burrito. Dip that into there, baby. Here we go. Mmm. Mmm. Wow. Wow. Thank you for the free napkin, Chipotle. Mmm. Bum. 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 Oh my gosh, that's fire. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, that barbecue's fire. Who knew that brisket would taste so good in a chipotle bowl like that? What the heck? Did not expect that at all. Chipotle, y'all did that good. Chipotle, y'all did that right. Get it right. I don't want to talk. Get it right. Get it right. Get it right. Bum. Try it, bum. Yeah, that was bomb. Guys, I did not expect that at all. All right, so let's really talk about this. Bomb, 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 bomb. Yo. Yeah, I had to bring up the old setup. I had to bring the OG setup, y'all. I had to bring the OG setup back. 
We had to bring it back. Run it back, run it back. Guys, let me tell you guys how much this was though. Like, I'm not even playing with you guys. Like, how many, let me tell you guys how much this was. $28 for a bowl, a large case one of large chips. $28. But I had a free little extra protein because I got extra chicken in this. So I got um I got the brisket and I got I added extra chicken. So that was like an extra five bucks, but it took off the five dollars. I'm like, damn though, like if I didn't have that extra thing and I wanted to get like extra meat. $28, $30 just for me. That's inflation. I've just been so unburdened by for what has been. Like, I've been so burdened for what has been. I have been just so burdened for what has been. It's crazy. Mmm. Oh my gosh. I think this every day. It's so good. Which I haven't really been doing their hot sauce because it changed. It used to be red, now it's orange. Something changed with their source of hot sauces and how they grow them, their chilies. It's not the same. It used to be really, 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 really good. But now it's like unbearably spicy. Or maybe it's just me. Let me know, guys. Do y'all like Chipotle? I, I stopped going here for a while. For like a minute. So this is getting too expensive. They were putting like no protein on it. But lately, ever since this brisket came out. Bomb. Lately, I don't know, I've just been, I've been digging it. Mm. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, so what do we think about Nicocado Avocado? Nicocado Avocado's back. He's back skinnier than ever. Honestly, I'm actually proud. I'm actually ha happy that he, that he did all that, you know? Like, honestly... It, 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 like I get it like I get it being on the other side of the camera like he was about like, people just saying a lot of bad things about you the fact that he did that is huge not easy I, I know that it wasn't easy at all like yeah, I don't that I lost 50 pounds and that wasn't easy But like imagine 250 pounds, like like hats off to you, like kudos to you, you know? That's not easy, I know that wasn't easy. And you have to have the amount of, just imagine the amount of like willpower that you have to have and like drive and everything to pull that off. You can't knock it, you can't knock it. People can say this, that, Ozempic, this, Ozempic. People said that I was on Ozempic. I was not on no, Ozempic, you know? So, does it look like I was on Ozempic? <laughs> I look the same. <laughs> but to do that, y'all give credit where credit is due, you know? But, yeah, and what are y'all's thoughts about that? Oh, you know, guys, oh, God, I, was, I was about to say, uh, you, you know what? I'm not a fan of their at Chipotle. I'm, I'm not a big fan of their veggies, like their bell peppers. I don't know. There's they're, they're just something about it that I don't like it in my bowls. If you guys want to go to Chipotle and get more bang for your bucks, get a bowl, 
you can make it into two burritos. Get a bowl, ask for two tortillas on the side. You can make two burritos out of that. And I, I haven't really been too active here on YouTube. But what's new? What's new in these mukbang streets? What is new in these YouTube streets? What is new in these YouTube streets? Mm. Anything new? Anything changed? Anything? Or same old? As, as, or or? Same talk. Or same old, same old. Mm. Let me update you guys on the trip that we went on. Okay, so you guys know that my parents moved to the south, right? We went to Kentucky, Tennessee, and Georgia. And... I thought I was going to be like, I'm leaving California, like, California, like, I'm done with California, like, yada, yada, yada. Yo, I went to Kentucky. We liked Kentucky a lot. Like, it was, it was, we liked it. It was nice. It was very clean. But it just, it, it wasn't for us. Um, we went to Tennessee. Nice. Um, the area that we like, it's really, 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 really expensive. And we're like, for this, we can stay in California, like, and not have any of the weather issues and just like all that kind of stuff, you know? And like still be around with what we know. Like there's no point. So we went to Georgia and then we're like, this is not, this is not for us. This is not for us at all. So yeah, where else should we go? <laughs> but no guys, honestly though, it, it was, it, it wasn't just not, it was just, when people say California has the best food, I agree. How's the best weather? I agree. Very nice. I agree. Beautiful beaches, all that stuff. Weather, all that. I agree. It's just the price is not the nicest. But you you get what you pay for. You literally get what you pay for. So, with that being said, I'm going to stay right here. For now, <laughs> I'm gonna stay right here. Just because, like, if everything, like, like food. There's like no food in the south. It's all fast food. Like Waffle House, Culver's, Chick Fil A, McDonald's, Taco Bell. There's no like places like how like y'all know that like my videos like those type of mukbangs, the chili cheese fries, onion rings, good like Korean food, hot pot, like none of that stuff. There's not really none of that stuff. And we went to North Atlanta to look at some, some really, oh, we really like that, the North Ad Atlanta area. If you're from that area, like Johns Creek, Alpharetta, Swanee, um, like all that area was really, really, really nice. But I'm like, this is same, basically the same price as California. Why move across the world? When we have everything there, and we know everything there. So, and if you're from Tennessee, we really liked um, Franklin, Brentwood, <laughs> but pricey. And Kentucky, when we went, when we went there, guys, I'm not even lying to you guys, when you see like pictures like on a calendar, of like this beautiful mansion, like I'm not. We weren't looking at mansions. We were just we were driving by because we didn't know anything. So we ended up in this area, literally mansions on like acres, and the lawn is like so groomed. Like you can see the lines in the lawn, and there's horses running around. I'm like oh my gosh, this is something that you would see like in a movie, like Kentucky Derby, like just like a beautiful Kentucky mansion, like with the 
it just looks, it doesn't look real. I mean, we don't get this in California. Like, it doesn't look like this. But again, it's out in the boonies, and we don't want to be out in the boonies. I thought I did want to be in a farm in the middle of nowhere, but I don't. I like being around people and, you know. So where are y'all from? Comment down below. And do you agree with what I said? So we've marked off Florida, nope. Tennessee, nope. Georgia, no. Arizona, nope. Kentucky, no. Nope. Nevada, nope. That leaves what? A few more states? It's basically like a, um, like a pros and cons list that we have. Well, we'll see. I'm gonna just stay here, y'all. I'm not going nowhere. But I must say though, like, like it was nice though. It was nice. It's so green in other states, like it's just crazy. But oh my gosh, did I really eat all this food? Because honestly, I miss talking to y'all. I miss filming a. I missed. I miss. Uh, honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I miss filming a mukbang. I miss like. Just I built so many. I built so many connections with, with a lot of you guys. Last year. What happened last year? Last year was a was 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 a good year. This year I was just I was just really focusing on myself and my health. I just, um, all that, and taking a break from YouTube and the stress of YouTube, and it's, I'm still here, I'm still here, but, y'all yeah, was saying for me to come back, so I'm like, I think maybe it's time, it's, it, guys, it's, it's almost been a year. It's been 10 months since I've done a sit down mukbang like, like like this. Since I've done a mukbang at all. 10 months. And you believe that. That was quick. That was quick. But you know what? It was a it was a needed 10 months though. It was very needed. I think it's important if you're in social media space to to take a break. If you're an influencer out there or you're trying to be an influencer, don't get burnt out. You have to enjoy it. Like for me, I was so burnt out that it became a job. And I see so many influencers that do mukbangs. You can see in their in their videos that it's become a job to them. It's like it's it's there's no effort. There's no like and that's how I was getting. I was I actually I was like that. And I mean, y'all know, for you guys who have been following me from the beginning, and then you, you kind of see like a decline of my passion for the videos and the mukbangs and all that stuff, like, you guys seen it, like, for y'all who have been supporting me for a very long time, and it was just like, I gotta film, I gotta eat, I gotta film, like, ugh, I gotta, I was very, ugh, I gotta film, I gotta film, like, this is a job, like, this is, it's becoming a job and I'm, and I'm hating it, I'm not knowing what to talk about, I, I'm losing the passion, but I miss, now that I took a long break away from it, to come back with like fire again, like how I, like how I used to be. It's just, obviously like not exactly how I used to be because I've grown and I've evolved and it's important to not always stay in the same place that, you know, things change, time changes, everything changes. Um, but yeah, and also like just being there for my family a lot more it has, has just, you know, it's, it's just been putting things in priority, I guess. I don't know. But here I am ranting. Y'all probably don't even care. If you guys are still at this, if you guys are still at this point right now, listening to me, leave me a little pumpkin emoji. See the little pumpkin? Comment a little pumpkin emoji. I'm going to shout you guys out in the next video. I'm going to shout you guys out in the next video. For you guys just listening to me ramble, like just to hear what I have to say, that really means so much. Leave me a little pumpkin emoji. And I'm going to write every single person 
his name down so I can give you guys a shout out in the next video. Just because, like, that just means a lot. And you guys care about what I have to say. But thank you guys so much for tuning in on this video, you guys. Chipotle is good. Um, but y'all can make this into two. Like, as you can see, I didn't really eat all of it. You guys can make two burritos out of that if you guys want to get burritos. Um, so get a big bowl and have them put extra rice, extra beans, which is free. Extra veggies, extra corn, whatever. All that stuff is free except for the meat. Um, and you can make two burritos and it'll be less than a dang two burritos by itself. I love you guys so much. Give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.